point to you. So which companies or brands do you feel are, are big companies are, are getting it right? Which ones kind of inspire you in that sense? I'm super sad this question was asked. Because, and I'll tell you why. I spend zero time knowing. I don't know. I, I spent, when I tell you I spend zero time, I have no idea who's doing it well. I'll never go by the media rags because it's not their fault. They're, they don't know the details. I mean, we did incredible, <coughs> incredible work at GE, but the business wasn't run well, so the business isn't healthy. To me, good marketing is only affecting the business. So just because Burberry or Taco Bell in the last decade have done some cool things, it has, I have no feel if it's actually dictating the business. For me, marketing is a driver to the business. So I know what's happening at Kraft or Pinnacle Foods or Johnson & Johnson that we're doing well, but that's not a fun answer to say my clients, right? Because a lot of my clients aren't doing it well because they're half pregnant on this thesis or haven't bought in. And so I don't know. I really don't. What's holding them back if, if your clients haven't bought in? They've bought into you. Yeah. Why but, haven't they bought into the whole concept then? Because they have a machine internally, whether it's their MMM or it's their bosses or it's their own political insecurities that are driving their behavior. Yeah. So why do you engage with them? Well, because you've got to, it, you know, for me selfishly, I started the media company and I'm, this is pretty known to every client that I work with because I eventually want to buy brands when the economy collapses. So I engage with them because I'm trying to look under the hood to understand if my pontifications are true. Right? So, and I'm collecting people. You know, there's a lot of, again, there's a lot of smart people in the industry who just have on the wrong jersey. It's like a good athlete. Sometimes they get traded and then they excel. So, how, how do you identify that talent? Through meetings. Through meetings. You know, you get to know people. At, you know, almost always, very few people are super bought into the extreme version. There's nuances they like. And then, and then you start seeing how people react to truth. If executives lean in on the first example of, oh my God, that media spend and creative spend actually drove our business, if they lean in, I'm intrigued by that. A lot of people push back because now it's a vulnerability. So I'm trying to figure out if somebody just wants to have a corporate career and maximize that for the next six years or are people thinking about 10, 20 years. So I'm, I'm reacting to just meetings, nothing super complicated.